Sweet Costa Rica here, here to talk about how to order a cookery from Tora Blades. I've gotten a lot of requests on this process, so here we go. Ordering is pretty straightforward. You just follow the prompts. The hard part is choosing the cookery that you like. There are so many different choices. Um, thin type, wide type, military type, villager type. Once you've ordered the cookery you like, now comes the hard part, waiting. After the earthquake in Nepal, there have been shortages everywhere to an already uh, slow system. So uh, it's going to take a little bit longer to get your tour blade. I pre-ordered and it took about four months for my cookery to arrive. So that's just an example. Here I am unboxing the cookery that I ordered. The sirupate is my favorite cookery, and Tora made this one very nicely. It weighs 480 grams, that's 17 ounces. The spine thickness is 7 millimeters, and that's 1 fourth inch. The sheath is also nice, too. There was some rust on the metal parts, but they polished out very easily. Maintenance of your cookery is simple but important. I learned these two techniques from Simon Hingle, the sandpaper technique and the oiling technique. With the sandpaper technique, all you need to do is buy wet and dry sandpaper, differing grits, and use a foam book for the base and just slide the blade backwards across the paper. The oiling technique is even simpler. You just put your kukuris in a container. You pour baby oil or mineral oil into the container and let the kukuri soak overnight. Also do this to the sheaths. Tora blades are lighter, thinner, more balanced and take the extra traditional steps in manufacturing that the others don't. I recommend them highly over the heavy tourist type blades and the so-called modern designs on the market today.